Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Call of Cthulhu. I'm here with Spring at Dawn, and we are uh, gonna try and head towards the the basement. Now, I have a sneaking suspicion. Never mind. My suspicion was incorrect. I thought I was gonna have to sneak back through here because again, there's all these lockers I can hide in, like that one over there. I can't hide in it right now, but uh. The same model locker that you can hide in with Pierce, and I was assuming I'm going the wrong way. You know, I don't actually remember where it's at. I've seen it, I just don't remember how to get there. That's his office. It's not this one, that's the operating room. That's Elizabeth. Officer Bradley's gone. Where the heck is the uh, that security door? There's like the uh, the the gate. At least the psychiatric ring wing. I don't remember where it's at. Oh boy. Um. Bathroom administration. Oh, here it is. Silly old me. How is this not like a warning? Maybe you shouldn't be going down here. What's up here? Hello. Ah, now that's the Marie that I know. I knew I could count on your scientific curiosity. It's time to show you what you were so eager to discover. I don't think I like that. If you're gonna shoot me, at least have the decency to look me in the eyes. Turn around. Slowly. Talk, filthy thief! Oh, I swear I'll shoot! Uh, let's see. Yeah, it was Charles Hawkins. Take a minute to look around. Everything points to Charles Hawkins. He's dead. No. He was here for a very specific item. Oh, no. The book. Why was it in the safe? Have you read it? Answer the question. How foolish of you. Now you won't be able to escape his will. What did it show you? I saw the... Uh, okay. She went into Fuller's office. She was looking for Sarah Hawkins' corpse. Sarah Hawkins, you say? Let's go back to the start, shall we? Whose life did the Necronomicon choose to show you? Dr. Colden. She was at the Riverside Institute. She's in danger. I have to go. Wait! No one knows the occult better than me. You might need my help. Yeah. All right. All right. I might need you after all. Perfect. Let's meet later at the Hawkins mansion. Now go. Rescue the doctor. Thank you, Drake. How am I going to rescue the doctor? <clears throat> this lips quivery. Let's see. The book projected Pierce into the body of Dr. Colton. The detective watched helplessly as Bradley's friend carried out her inquiry. Confronted with the experiments of Fuller, she got into his office and discovered that the director of the Riverside Institute was hiding information on, if not the body of, Sarah Hawkins. As she was discovered by Fuller, Pierce must save her before it's too late.
Oh, so he's probably got to use the lockers to sneak through. I pray that Colden is really here and alive. Oh, here's volume one. Uh, the diary. So I didn't miss it. That's that's cool. Uh, the diary of Reverend Wick, Wick, Wickwood's wife, her husband John, built the first Hawkins home called Hilltop at the end of the 17th century. They were among the first white colonists of the island. The previous inhabitants disappeared mysteriously three centuries earlier. The old diary. Oh, this is okay. This is Fuller's office. Piece of dust. It's terrifying. Yeah, change lights. We don't need the uh, lantern out right now. So I can't hide right now. What the... Fuller, too. So everybody's taking sleeping pills. I got an achievement for finding this one. Maybe this is the last one in the game. It's called the, uh... Most something object. Right. Enough time wasted. Colden needs me. I must find her. Okay, it's just the uh, doctor people. I don't have to hide from monsters or anything. Can I go in here? Make sure they're not like coming up behind me. Can't get to the pharmacy? Well, I can't get into anything. I'm gonna check. Just wanna look for, you know, secrets and stuff. Make sure I don't miss anything. Can I get through this grate? No, it's a little small. A little snug. What's in here? Locker room. What was this? Administration. Also a no-go. Can't open up that door. Assuming I just can't go past those guys. Did I try this door already? I think I did. Happening to me. You have no idea, man. Oh. What was that? That's trippy. It's as if I'd been transported somewhere else. You're telling me. What are symbols? Do I just keep. Did it fell out the other way? Hello. <clears throat> Medicine and Secret Sciences. This very interesting book, aimed at a wide public, demonstrates how non-recognized sciences have influenced modern medicine. Magnetism, grandmother secrets, Chinese acupuncture, hypnosis, herbal medicine, alchemy, and many others have contributed to a certain extent to the enrichment of medicine at the beginning of the century. So medicine got a little better. Anything in the bathroom? Someone needs to use a coaster in here. Also, you probably shouldn't be drinking out the toilet while you're... Can I change my light? No, I'm gonna run out of this lantern if I'm not careful. Okay, so it keeps transporting me to the same place. What do I need to do here? Oh, I didn't go in here. I hear the darn shambler. It's another door that leads in there. But I can't get to it here. There's all these symbols. But I don't know what they mean. Or if there's any significance to them currently. Um. Block A. Another burst of lantern really quick. Um, 
This will take me back to the same place, but it refills my lantern for me. So that's nice. Oh boy. Alright, let's be a little more thorough. Let's go back around everything one more time. Check all the corners and the uh, nooks and crannies again. So there's that symbol. So I wonder. I mean, the symbols are going to play a part. So this symbol appears twice. Well, then you have the snake symbol. I don't know exactly what it is. And Cthulhu symbol, Cthulhu symbol. Are they the same Cthulhu symbol? Yeah. No. One has a hole in it, one doesn't. I wonder what these mean, because there's two of these. I can't interact with them in any way, shape, or form. I need to get back there. But when I try to go through that door, it transports me back to the beginning. Maybe if I use... If I do this... Nope. Alright, so yeah, I'm not sure. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do now. So there's another Cthulhu symbol over there. I don't have a lot of area to explore, and I can't jump over the desk. There's a door right there. I have no way to get over to it. without clearing out these symbols first. Which doesn't look like I can do. This is the way I was trying to go. Yeah, I have no idea. Um, I mean, I tend to not have an idea. I've begin something anyway. Can I... It's weird that I can even come into this room. But this is where I need to interact with something. Uh, let's see. I'm just run around in circles for an entire episode. We're we gotta figure this out. So I keep hearing the monster. He sounds like he's over this way. Lantern's on in there. Do I just keep running in circles till it takes me somewhere else? So I have no idea. Hmm. I can't put my lantern away at all. lead me to right there. I need to get right there. But I don't know how to... See, it just cuts off. I don't think that's... Why does it run out of light? Uh, fills up when I come back over here. Okay. Thanks to the light source. Oh. What happened? Something has changed, but what? <laughs> that whole time I just get running past that lantern. Jeez Louise. Nothing back here. It's all smoky. Alright. 
Okay, and the pseudoscientific work by Yeah, we've already read about this. Oh, that's silly of me. I can't believe I didn't grab the lantern earlier. Well, I think I checked it the first time, but it wasn't interactable the first time, right? Or maybe it was interactable when I just messed up. Alright, so something has changed. I need to find... I mean, obviously I can open the door now. It's got the outer sign scribbled all over it. Which means here I should be safe from... The old ones. Hmm. Yeah, I don't see any changes here. Let's, uh... Check the bathroom and stuff again. I can't hold up my lantern any longer. I can't, like, aim it at anything. Also, to have unlimited fuel. Hmm. Oh, wait, there's another lantern. Oh, hold on. So each lantern changes the, um... Okay. Where have I seen this symbol? So they... All right, so that erased that symbol, right? So now I can go through here. Okay. So next I have to get rid of that symbol, wherever that's at. Okay, all right, I, I know what I need to do now. Where's this take me? Do the once around with this lantern, then we do the once around with the other lantern. Easy peasy. Let's see if I grab the other lantern and uh, see what we can't do. Let me see the baths. So I have to erase the symbol before I can open the door, right? I guess I didn't try to open the door. Screw it, let's go. Yeah, you gotta get rid of the symbol first. It is trapped. Has it though? It's leading me back here again. Or no, it's taking me to the wall. Okay. So I can get rid of this one and the other one, right? Maybe it naturally get rid of the other one anyway? Let's 
So if I go over here, yeah, this is going to be dissipated as well. Oh, crap. I can't see anything on my lantern right now. Well, that's rough. Um... Oh! Alright, you don't want to run out of light. <laughs> you don't... Don't want to run out of light. Let's, uh, let's grab this one. I'm assuming this makes it safe to navigate. I could be wrong. So I'm assuming there's going to be a symbol in this room that I need to destroy. So I have to sneak past that darn spooky spooks. Um, I don't like there's any other doors for me to open, so I think I need the other lantern right now. Yeah. It's gotta find, I think, I guess that symbol is gonna be in there somewhere. Which makes me wonder, because there is the other symbol that I don't think we've deactivated yet, right? It was, um, yeah, the Cthulhu symbol. Oh, because I need to go that way. See, that might be the last one. We'll probably come from the other side of that, that symbol, and then, you know, run straight this way. Alright, well, let's see if we can uh, get in there and take care of that symbol before a uh, spooky monster gets us. Confronting powers that surpass you. Did they surpass me? What happened to the creature there? It wasn't even in the room, I don't think. The game not save? I'm just making a dash for it, though. Well, this is a dead end. Let's look around for books and stuff. In all actuality. I doubt there'd be any, like, medical books in the main lobby here. I mean, I hear the monster, so let's see it. Right now I'm just desperate for a save point. Oh, here we go. Book of Medical Sciences, like a dick- yeah, we've already. All right, I'm about to run out of uh, special juice here. That's not good because then I can't see. Yeah, we're we're not in a good spot now. We're about to die. Cause I'm out of light, and I can't see where I'm going. Yeah. Okay, well I'm gonna call it here. We know what we need to do, we know the direction we need to take, and we'll um Yeah, we'll take care of it in the next episode. Anyway, uh thanks for watching and hope to see y'all in the next episode.